Hello everyone, welcome to Next Gen AI Academy. Till now, we have completed length, two lower case, two upper case, trim, and concord. In this video, we will be learning about equals method and how to do the comparison between the string. Then, using index concept, we will be learning about character at index of method. Let's begin the coding. The next method, which is most used method, especially in the automation, this will be the starting condition in many control statement. Before starting this, some basics we must know it. The computer always differentiate or identify based on the ASCII number. So when someone type capital E means in the back end, the capital E value is 65 and if it is a small E means that is lower case means it's a 97. Always keep it in mind Java is a case sensitive so capital E and small E are not same. Same way when we do a string comparison the string comparison will happen based on this as key number not on based on the character. The first one is two-way comparison for two-way comparison we use the equals method this method returns true if the strings are equal if it is not equal obviously it will be false it will check character by character whether the ASCII numbers are same in this example we will be using two variable string value value 4 and value 5 Ajit it may sound same but here the first letter is capital A and in this variable it is small a let's do the comparison sysout value 4 dot equals value 5 so we know variable so when we execute what it will happen is it will check for these two letter whether both the letter having same ASCII number both of them are not same so we will get output as false let me execute and show you here it is false we can also compare the string using double equal to like how we saw it in operators no double equal to value 5 same way so both of them mean same but in real time scenario we will be using equals method let me change to both of them small a run it it is true okay let me change this as a capital h it will compare character by character a j i t everything same case but h is different so we will get output as false Suppose I don't want to compare case that is whether lower case or upper case I just want to compare only both the string are same or not for that we have an additional method value for dot equals and you can see here right equals ignore case what this will do it will compare the string to another string and ignoring the case consideration when we use equals ignore case it will not worry about small h and the capital H the output will be true and you can see here the first two example it is false and the third example it is true so this is the two-way comparison so the next one is three-way comparison in real-time scenario especially in automation we will be using two-way only but we will learn for knowledge purpose using compare to method also we can do the string comparison so when it compares string 1 with string 2 what it will do is it will same way it will try to compare with the ASCII value and it will try to do the subtraction while doing the subtraction if the output is 0 it means both the strings are same if the output is positive value means 
it will tell string 1 is greater than string 2 if it is a negative value means string 1 is less than string 2 this will be little bit confusing let's see with simple example we already know one thing the ascii value of small a is 97 capital a is 65 it means this value is greater than this value let's try to do the comparison and check whether we are getting this output or not sysout value 6 dot compared to value 7 and what will be the output string 1 is greater than string 2 then we will get the positive value number and you got the output as 32 how 32 if you check small a value is 97 minus 65 means it is 32 it means it's doing the subtraction okay let me make both of them same the output will be 0 we know it let's do the reverse operation value 7 is compared to value 6 now string 1 is less than string 2 it will come negative value so minus 32 same like equal ignore case we have compare to ignore case let's learn that also value 6 dot compare to ignore case value 7 both the string as same so we got output 0 it means small a and capital E are same let's try Australia updated the input value when we execute now it will go character by character and will give output like this so this is called three-way comparison the next string method character are from now whatever the method we are learning everything works based on index number in any programming language if we deals with index value remember it starts with zero any programming language if it is an index means the search or the count starts from zero when we implement this method it will returns the character of the mentioned index value let's learn that with an example we have a string called id and uh, this is the string automation course and you have some id number now let's try to find the character at the variable dot the first method itself character at you mention any index number maybe i will mention number 5 so what will be the output let's try to visualize it as i already said index value starts from 0 so let's assign the index number same concept will be used for all the upcoming methods so focus here well a means index 0 u means it is 1 t means it is 2 3 4 5 and so on so when i execute this program if you mention number 5 means at index number 5 what is the character available is small a let me execute and show you you can see the output it is small a and next method index of that is reverse of this one when you mention the character that will return the index number we know the variable name course id dot index of we have to mention the specific character no it's a single code small a we already know phi when we execute you will get output as phi whenever you want to find the character using index means then you can use character at and when you want to find the index number using character means you can use index of one more scenario here what is the index of t 
because we have 2t in this case it will display only the first occurrence of that particular character so the output will be 0 1 2 the output is 2 let me make even more complicate now I want to find this particular t not this one then what is the way to do it we have to mention an additional argument or a parameter I have to tell from which particular index you have to start the search maybe I can mention number 5 5 means it will start search from here and it will display the index of the second now the output is 6 let me explain the this scenario first we will assign the index number 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so on if I mention this particular argument means from the fifth position only it will start the search so from here when you will get t so from here means this is the first occurrence of a t and its index value is 6 whenever you want to find some values based on your requirement you can use index of using two argument also that's the end of this video thanks for watching happy learning